do we even need to ask? I mean, I, I, honestly, this is so infuriating. I don't even know what to do. I don't even know if I care what the process is that these judges are arriving at. Whatever it is, it's flawed. I can tell you that much. I mean, D David put it well. It's This is a different process for, for, for this person. We have decided that he gets his own private court of justice. He has a private plane. He has a he has private clubs that he lives in. You know, apparently, you know, he he basically fashioned himself his own private militia to try to take over the Capitol. You know, now he's getting uh, his own private system of justice. This is an absolute travesty. It would not happen for anybody else. Anybody else, it would be like, sorry, buddy, you lost. Pay up. For him, he gets his own set of rules. Legally, Tristan, how is that done? We just saw it. They just decided that they just, you know, the appellate court has now just decided they're going to swoop in and just change it. And that's it. And now the uh, the AG's office can now try to go up above them, I believe. You know, I don't know what the details are because you just told us. I'm guessing this is coming from the first department, appellate division, first department. That's the intermediate mm -hmm. court here in New York. Uh, but in my view, this is, without knowing more, unless there's some sort of other extenuating circumstance that we're going to learn here, this appears to be an absolute gross miscarriage of justice.